to know how did he make his wealth? How did he make this so much very big wealth that he can afford the bullion van prior to an election in his home? That's a staggering, colossal amount of wealth. How did that wealth come about? Because I think if I check his resume, the last thing I saw was accounts out with mobile. You know, what, what business does, does he do? He's been in government for a while. How did he make that wealth? That's one. Two, there's been discrepancies about his age. I ask you, how old is he? Uh, well, let me tell you, you see, uh, this, this, these two questions you've just posed, uh, it's part of what I have answered earlier. I think at this point that we've got into, our emphasis should be on the pedigree of this candidate, what he has demonstrated that he has done, what he has achieved, how he has changed the revenue of Lagos State, how he has put a long-term plan to implement infrastructure. Infrastructure. He has ensured that he instilled discipline. Honorable Jibril. How much people that he has built. Honorable Jibril. These are the focus that we should concentrate on. Honorable Jibril. Because most of these political issues that we keep raising front and back will not solve the problem. So the emphasis now, the focus now, should be on the capacity and the competence okay. of this candidate. Honorable Jibril. How did Bola Ahmed Tinubu make yes. his money? That's all I want to know. You can tell me and what we can focus on. And, and we'll talk why, about it in the manifesto. How and, did Bola Tinubu make so much money that he had a bullion van in his home on election day? And how old well, is he? Those are the questions that well, people are asking out there. How old is he? Well, how did he make also, the money? I'm also putting it... I'm also now, you've asked your question clearly, and I will give you a simple and clear answer. And, now, and, now ask, and when you continue to repeat the question, you will get the same answer. These are all trash from the internet that people keep putting it together, and we will not elevate such conversations. But when the campaign commences, we will bring out facts and figures and put before Nigerians. But we will not create a narrative for them. So for now, the emphasis is on the competence of the candidate, what he has achieved, the network he has built, the people he has invested in, and his plan for a better Nigeria. All right. Uh, can, can I ask you this? How was this trash? Bullion Van was found in his home. The pictures were viral, and there's been no denial. So how are you saying that is trash? And how is it trash that we want to know how the person that will lead Nigeria made so much wealth? You know, and also the declaration of being rich in a hostile state. So how? Is, that's not trash. What? How did he make his money? That's all I want to know. And tell me how old he is so I can take you by something because there's been discrepancies too by the people of his age and his wealth it's just a question I'm asking please and and, and Rufai is just an answer that I'm giving you as well